Hey guys, let me just do a quick intro for this video, even with all of the bad light. Hey y'all, hey, I am still here. Thank y'all for those of y'all who have checked on me in the comments. Um, especially, let's see, off the top of my head, I know Magenta Auto Travels, you you, you checked on me. you like, hey, I haven't been seeing any videos. Um, I also know that um, Tasha, I talked to you yesterday. I can never, I can remember people's names more than I can remember channel names. Like if your channel name is not your name, for some reason it's easier to, for me to remember your name name. But the channel names, major change group. Look at that. I can continue driving now. Major change group. Um, I talked to you on the phone yesterday because you was checking on me like, are you okay? Are you quitting YouTube? Like what's going on? I am not quitting YouTube. So let me tell you guys what I'm going to do because I do have lots of videos that I need to edit that I have not gotten around to editing just yet because life has been super busy. Um, I've been traveling and then I've been just doing good things. So this is what I'm going to do. I made a video yesterday. I was going to almost do like a this week's goals or something just encompassing the whole week and make it into one video but let's just release them day by day let's just release them every day okay um so whatever i recorded yesterday we're gonna record we're gonna release from yesterday and then today's video i'm gonna release you know by itself as a standalone and um i did do my budget because i know tasha major change group she asked me about you didn't even do a budget it's like i did do a budget i do budgets period like whether um recording them for a video or not i live by a budget like that's my jam right there i love knowing what my money is doing and i love knowing more importantly if something pops up can i handle it how am i going to handle it what needs to be done for me to handle it um and right now y'all is the season of handling ish i'm gonna make another video about all of the financial emergencies and financial things that have popped up in my life in this just this past month and show y'all what that looks like but in the meantime i'm gonna go ahead and release yesterday's video i'm gonna release today's video i'm gonna work on editing my budget video so even though they're late i always think that there's a lesson that can be learned gleaned found said in a video even if it's not like the first of the month so we're gonna get that good um march budget review because it was a hot mess and then we're gonna also get my budget for april um you know and thank y'all for being here. Thank y'all for not giving up on me. All is well. Um, I just ain't had time. That's all. That is all. Okay, on to the video. Bye. Happy Monday. It's Monday, guys. Monday. I feel like yesterday. Yesterday, I feel like it was Friday. The weekend. I know exactly where it went. It went all throughout my body and all of those things. Y'all, Saturday and Sunday, I was at the house in the in Maryland. I was at the Maryland property working all day. Um, Saturday, we left like around 10 p.m. Sunday, I left like about 9 p.m. Got there at around 9 a.m. in the morning. So we literally worked there from morning till night. And I am exhausted. My feet hurt. My hands hurt. My fingertips hurt. My back hurt. My everything hurts. Um, shout out to my amazing friends. My support system. Woo! Because they were there with me. They were there with me. I was like, can I go home? Please let me go. I know I asked y'all for help. But can y'all please release me? Because Corinne drank some dang on coffee. And it was ready to go throughout the entire night I wasn't so around 10 she let us leave and she went to her house and continued to work I'm like uh uh I wish coffee did that to me I, does coffee give y'all energy like that like y'all take a baby sip and y'all just wired for years I wish it did that to me because I could use that energy I could use it but guys at the house we painted like the banisters and stuff and um which we've never painted banisters before. So we had to like try to. First we was going to try to hand sand them. And borrow a machine to sand them. Then we got some stuff that you spray on them. That will strip them. So it was just a whole process of prepping them. Trying not to mess up all the other beautiful paint. That's already painted. And then painting them. 
so we did that now today is Monday guys now God, oh, it's, it's just a it's just a thing here's the thing here's the thing this is the main thing Saturday Saturday I fly out to Miami y'all know the story got a whole man so fly out to Miami on Saturday so therefore today Monday I got to do all the things what I'm gonna check when I get in the office today is how much vacation time do I have? Because this is going to be one of them weeks where this week and next week, obviously, they go together. I'm not going to... I hope I'm not going to do the most to try to get in hours. I might just have to take good old-fashioned vacation time. Um, because today, Monday, it would be ideal if I could work 10 hours. But here's the challenge. The challenge is... I have to go over to the Maryland property today to meet somebody regarding hanging um, lights. I got four lights that I would like to have hung. And so I got to see what they're going to quote me to do the job. Honestly, I don't want, I want to pay somewhere like about $50 per light. That's what I want to pay. I I think that maybe they may charge between fifty and a hundred dollars per light, but y'all, this stuff is adding up. Um, just the little things, just the little the prep stuff that you need, just all of that. Um, so yeah, so we'll see. We don't have light hanging experience. Um, so that's one. Two, my friend Brooke is in town, and she actually leaves Tuesday. She's coming, she's in here from LA, so I would like to see her. I'm going to reach out to her today and propose that maybe we have dinner tonight. Um, yeah, I got to just make these things happen. Uh, we've been in touch off and on throughout the weekend, but like I said, I've been at that place, so I've been missing phone calls, this, that, and the other. Three on Tuesday... This car, y'all, is janky right now. I'm climbing in through the passenger door to open up my driver's side door because the door handle's not presenting. They're fixing that tomorrow. So I have an appointment between noon and 5 tomorrow where they're going to be fixing it. Now, my hope is that maybe I'll just work from home a little bit while they're doing that. So I'm going to line up some home things that I can do for work. Then, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, again, ideally, I don't know, the strategy would be to work at least 10 hour days. That way I'll get at least 50 hours in so that when I'm off three days next week, I offset that time so I don't have to take, you know, all those hours of vacation. But here's the thing, going to Miami, hair is not done, eyelashes are not done, nails are not done priority is to get my hair done because my hair needs to be done whether I was going to Miami or not my hair needs to be done I took out those full locks and it's just a take a mess you know no love no no hydration no nothing so it needs TLC so I think today I'm also gonna look to make a hair appointment to get my hair like you know just nice wash deep condition um, and curled up. So I gotta fit that in too. Eyelashes are not a priority. Nails are not a priority. Because I can figure out something in Miami if it comes down to that. But that's that's the thing, y'all. That's what's happening this week. It's, it's just another day in my life, another week in my life where... I am doing a little bit of scrambling in preparation for the next thing. I haven't had time to really do a lot of editing, y'all, because it's just been little things popping up, road trips, stuff like that. And um, I can't edit on the road. I'm driving. <laughs> Woo, y'all. So that's what it is. I hope y'all are doing well. Y'all okay. Y'all all right out there. Any major changes going on in y'all's lives? Until I pick y'all up again. I'll pick y'all up again when we on our way to go um, talk about the chandeliers in the light situations. Hey, y'all. Okay. It's like 11 a.m. right now. 
we left work and we're on our way to Maryland to the property. So all is well, all is well. Um, I talked to Brooke and she's leaving tomorrow, but she's actually leaving from the airport by my house and she has a rental car. And so what we're gonna do is she's gonna come to my home tomorrow because remember, I gotta be at home. Tesla, they're coming to my house to fix my car. So I gotta be at home between noon and five. So it just works out perfectly that she just comes and spends that time with me at my home and we can go do a brunch because I can just leave my car in the driveway and they, you know, they Tesla, they can get in your car. So all is well. And then plus I'll have my phone app, my phone so I can unlock the car if need be. But I'm excited about that. It all works out. And um, on my way to the house right now, it seems like I'm going to get there at 11.25. And she says between 11.30 and 11.45. So what I'm going to do is stop by Home Depot real quick and pick up one light switch cover. I was one cover short. So I'm going to pick that up at Home Depot real quick. So that while I'm at the house, I can go ahead and put that up. And then I can change some doorknobs. I have some doorknobs up there that need to be changed so I can do those things while waiting I like to be productive for the most part but I also know sometimes I just be running tired and then that's when you'll see me sitting playing phone apps and things like that but for the most part I try to make good use of my time now I'm gonna tell y'all Jay is the king of making good use of his time he he runs circles around me because he just doesn't like sitting still so he runs circles around me and he doesn't really watch TV and he doesn't play video games or phone app games like me and things like that so a lot of his time is not wasted I think the most he ever does to waste time is he be scrolling through like Instagram but normally that's on like like for instance when we were um at a store like Home Depot or whatever or any store and if I'm looking at stuff he's usually scrolling and I'd be like be present but at the same time it's like but he really ever just sits and just looks at the internet ever really hardly ever so I can't even complain about the little downtime he takes for himself because outside of that he's always getting into something which makes him a great partner and helper because he be coming through and helping me so much when he is around me. So that is totally awesome. He makes me feel so lazy. But um, but yeah, but I be getting a lot done too in my own right. I just, sometimes I'm just, I don't feel, I'm tired. So yeah. So okay guys, see y'all possibly at the house. I don't think there's nothing to see in Home Depot. I'm just picking up one light switch cover. All right, guys. We are actually on our way back to the J-O-B. And, y'all, we had some good luck. So, the company came by to look at everything that I wanted. And they said they're going to text me with an estimate. But then, as they were leaving, the company that's doing the work actually pulled up. And that was that, right? So they leave, they're coming in. And I was like, oh, so what are you guys doing today? And they were like, oh, we're gonna, um, some more lights came in. So they said they're gonna hang some lights, this, that, and the other. And then they said the project manager's about to come by and then you can tell him where you want everything hung. So I was like, oh, great. I will wait for him to come by. And so I waited and he came and I showed him where to put the lights that they were placing. And then I, he seen that I had other lights. He says, oh, you have these? And I said, oh, yeah, those are the ones I got. He goes, oh, well, while we're here, we could just hang those too. Y'all. Y'all. For free 99 they hung, they're hanging. They just started hanging the lights that I had. Now, there's one light that they said they couldn't hang because they didn't have the ladder for it, but it, it was the pendant light. So, that's what's going down. So, later on today... I think Corinne may be able to go by to see exactly what they hung and what they didn't hang. And this way, when the other company 
gives me the estimate I can revise it and say what about this and unfortunately for them it may only be one light and I don't know they might feel like one light might not be worth their time so we'll see but I just think it's so freaking dope that this is all coming together oh and they started hanging the um putting the pulls on the cabinet doors too so that's what's happening there but the flooring is not in yet the um the other bar the wet bar for the basement that's not in yet um and none of the appliances are in yet but that's where we are y'all that's where we at so i'm excited things are really coming along things are really coming along so y'all this day is not going as planned it's raining. It was sleeting not two seconds ago. It was just 80 degrees the other day. But in any time, anyways, I was, it's 3 p.m. I'm not back at work. I was back at work. But then as I was getting out of the car to go back into the building, I realized I've had some women issues. Like, ain't I too old for this? Oh my goodness. So I ended up having to go home and getting dressed again let's just say that i know it look like i got the same things on i just had to change my bottoms all the bottom stuff wash clothes and um now my car because we went to maryland and came back and blah 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 I'm, i only have 29 miles on my battery right now so i have to actually charge the car I just told y'all all the things about all the things that we needed to do and how we needed to manage our time and now this so I'm gonna get something to eat real quick and then I'm going to um, charge the car real quick and then I'm gonna go back to work real quick just thought I would share